We support Jose, a hardworking, faith-filled, and family-oriented man. Since the end of June, Jose Robles has been seeking sanctuary in this sanctuary. He came here just before he was scheduled to board a flight to Mexico, he said through an interpreter. In this situation that I find myself in, it's one of the most difficult I've ever had to face. So Gethsemane Lutheran is his new home, though this father of three would rather be with his family. Mi familia siempre ha sido para mí primero. Family has always come first for me, and this is why this is tearing my heart apart. Because I love my daughters, my wife, and I can see how this is impacting them, especially my youngest daughter, Natalie. Uh, Jose has been fighting his deportation case for over eight years now. Since his attorney called this meeting to discuss his latest options. They see two, an emergency stay from the Board of Immigration Appeals or a signature from Lakewood Police certifying that he was the victim of a violent crime and qualifies for a U visa. Some sanctuary cases um, have lasted six months to nine months. Um, we're not sure what the timeline is exactly right now, um, but that's um, if, if Lakewood doesn't sign it's really up to my client to decide how long he'd want to be in sanctuary. They tried to deliver pens to Lakewood police, a symbol of the signature he needs, but they were turned away. So he'll continue to wait inside the walls of this church. This has been the, the most uh, impactful and our family has been very damaged psychologically because of this. Lakewood police didn't get back to us in time today, but they previously said they don't make any comment about someone's immigration status, so they cannot discuss this. And with that, guys, it looks like Robles could be in for a long fight.